Hi all, uh, yeah, and welcome back to our Terraria 1.3 Let's Play. I've just been down killing the bee boss, as you can see, and what a fight! Damn. Um, as you can see, I have made a couple of more uh, of these. I actually had uh, ten in all, but I died two times trying to kill that freaking bitch, and I got her once. And this is what I got out of it. Uh, I got a pair of boots. Uh, the beast knees bow. Ooh, that's actually a quite good one. Oh damn, that's a good one. Oh yeah, wait a minute. Uh, I have. Um, there you go. Now it doesn't have any modifiers. Twenty six range. That's still pretty good. Wooden arrows turns into bees. Okay, let's let's check this out. Oh, that is cool. Okay, it's not the um, it's not full auto uh, like this one is, but it does shoot in a straight line. So yeah, and this is one is the, it is the demonic hellwing bow and only gets twenty three damage. This one is the bee's knees and gives twenty six damage, but when I Put on these three here with the the damage modifiers. Twenty nine. Whoo! Let's see. What can we get? The uh, oh, come on. There we go. Uh, where is that little? Oh, there he is. What can we get this thing up to? Annoying, awful, silious. That's critical strike. Frenzying. Minus damage, but plus in speed. No, hell no. Rapid. Ooh. That's actually pretty good. But let's see what else we can get. This one was demonic. Annoying. Awkward. We got 40. Uh, 44 gold left. Murderous. Oh, I'm gonna keep it at that. I am gonna keep it at that. Plus speed, critical strike, and 8 damage. 31 range damage. Hoo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Ah, damn. Oh, yeah, th my uh, Night Fury got it to legendary. Damn, that is uh, that's probably the bow we're gonna use for uh, um, the Wall of Flesh, dudes. Oh, let me just. Uh, uh, here we go. The pass, no, not the pass at all. Quick stack. There we go. Oh, wait a minute. I need to go back here. Ooh, almost a platinum, dude. Almost a platinum. Okay, what else did we get? Okay, that one we have. Oh! What? The Majestic Beacon! Oh, damn! But it's only 11 in magic damage. And I got the damage modifiers on. Wait a minute. 13, okay. Hmm, that's actually... That's actually pretty cool for a beacon. What, what the heck does it do? Oh, that's pretty cool. Nice. Mana uses four. Cool. Honey goggles. <gasps> no way! Rideable beam on what? Yeah, I got the. Um, let me just show you that from a fishing quest. Sorry, I didn't show that one earlier. Got the rideable bunny from a fishing quest. But if we could get the B mount, which is a flying mount. So, is it a. Uh, no, no. I can't, can't, can't keep it flowing. Uh, but. Uh, 
gotta get up, 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 Then it just slowly goes down again. Oh, that's cool. Oh my god, my god, my god. <laughs> okay, it's actually pretty cool that it uh, actually uh, loses momentum. Oh my god, you're so freaking heavy, you stupid son of a bitch. Yeah. I, that is, this is this is pretty pretty cool. This is a pretty cool mount. Yeah. Uh, going down. And when we really can whoop. Pretty cool. That's the B mount for you. Whoop. Okay, uh B gun. Yeah. So which one should I keep, the B mount or the uh, fuzzy carrot? I'm gonna keep the B mount because it's a flying one. Even though it, the uh, the bunny can actually run pretty goddamn fast, and I got double jump with it. Hmm. I'm gonna keep the B mount. Bam! Now with you. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay, that's gonna go over here. Bam, down with you. Oh, let me just switch over to this again. Uh, we don't need this one because we already have a. Yay! We actually got two. Oh well. Oh yeah, I put one of them uh, down. Uh, yeah. Oh, yes. Ah, there we go. Okay, two gold, two gold, almost three gold. No, we're not gonna sell that one, and we're not gonna sell the bow. We are, however, gonna sell one of these. We don't need two of them, uh, so let's sell the one that uh, gives the most. Bam. Also, gonna give him that one. We don't need that. We ha already have one. Okay. Murderous, nice. Can't wait to uh, start using that. Um, gonna go over here. Weapons. Put that one up here with the guns. <laughs> Lord, I got so many javelins. It's ludicrous. Flaming arrow. Hellfire arrow. Dude, we need to buy some wooden arrows. Flaming arrows, just the car arrows. We need to buy some wooden arrows because this one uh, makes them into bees and it's that's much better with the wooden arrows. Yeah, even though the other arrows give more damage. Doesn't matter. Okay, let's go up here. And yeah, let's uh, bam. And then say favorite that one. Gonna go back down here. Oh yeah, by the way, I have changed the um, changed it up so the uh, mushroom biome is down here and the jungle biome is up here. It's just because I didn't want the um, it to be a dark background up here. Always dark. This is the old world and it has to be a light, fluffy place. <laughs> okay. Um, oh shit! Damn, that was wrong. Couldn't can't get. Ah, oh, it only stacks in ninety nine. Okay, damn. I thought I thought this stacked in a uh, hundred uh, nine hundred ninety nine. God damn it. Okay, uh, let's see. No, let's take some of these out here. There we go. 
explosives. We're gonna take the bombs. Cool. The cool thing about the bomb fish is they are already, um, they already, uh, yeah, uh, stick to whatever uh, surface you throw them at. Huh? Oh, those are slime blocks. Damn, I'm uh, I'm tripping here. What the hell? There we go. These are slime blocks. Not the gel. <laughs> Lol. Let me just one, two, three, four, five. I wanna see where uh, see what those five are. Damn. Um Okay, uh okay. Explosives. Just gonna put a couple of them down here. There we go. We'll keep those. Bam. These are normal nades. Could be pretty cool to have that one. Dude. I just had a wicked idea. We can uh, set up traps now with the... Uh, ooh, I have, an, I have a wicked idea. We got three explosives, we got three detonators. What if... I of course initiate the wall of flesh over here, he comes from this side, and goes that way, because of... Uh, uh, in the middle of it, if we, we initiate it here, he would either come from this side or this side, it's random. But because it's so far off the middle from this side, he always comes from this side over here. But... I initiate him here, we start going backwards, shooting at him, and then I have a bomb here, and then a detonator over here, and when he goes over it, I detonate it. Boom! And set up those detonators along the road here, three of them, one, two, and three, right? So when he goes over them, I use the bombs in here these huge ones here to detonate him dude we're gonna try and do that yeah tinkers uh, that and that that should be enough Yeah, and I need, uh, I can't have it to be a pressure plate if I accidentally detonate and he's not close. I have, to, it has to be the detonator. So let's, uh, let's go down and, let's go down and have some fun. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, what am I doing? Oh, with the imp. What am I doing? If I had hit anything right now, I would have been dead meat. Okay. Bam. One, two, and three. Uh, let's just put this one on and this one on. This one increases the damage they do. So, yeah. So I can still have a little bit of run speed here. Also, down here after um, Skeletron, these guys down here can actually drop a pretty cool um, uh, yo-yo. So let's hope that they do that. Whoa!
Okay, and here it is. One bomb. Thank you. Ah, fucking hell. Ah. Okay. Um. Maybe that's a bit too close. Yeah, when I start initiate him. Oh, for fuck's sake. Let's see when we get back down there. And so I am back. Now I've placed him. Detonator. Bomb. As you can see here. They are connected. And there's. Detonator there, detonator, bomb, detonator, and bomb. Yeah, I died there a bit ago, so yeah. Whew, let's get the heck out of here. Okay, and also, um, been mining up some hellstone here. Um, because I want to build the, uh, cool. Uh, I want to make um, the molten armor here. I need 45. I only need five, six, seven. I need seven more in order to get the full, uh, the full set. Well, uh, maybe uh, do I have the full set? I'm not sure. Ah, no, I got uh, two uh, two pieces of the set. Okay, I only need uh, the chest piece then. Oh. <laughs> ah. Gotta love it when you accidentally click the wrong freaking button. Okay, molten chest piece. Bam. Thirty-seven in defense. Melee damage, sweet. Yeah, that's this one too. Sixty four, nice. And thirty two, sweet. Nice. Okay. Oh yeah, by the way, when I was down there, I got this one, the Demon Scythe. That's pretty cool. So, with um, all of the damage things on, and the magic thing, uh, magic damage on, is 55 magic damage. But I am down to 30 in the defense. Here it's 39. Yeah, and it cost us uh, 14 mana to use. But it is actually quite a lot of damage, I must admit. So yeah, uh, I'm thinking of uh, saying bye bye to this staff here, right here. Yeah, I'm only gonna use my uh, small minions from now on. Okay.
cool. Hey, the traveling merchant. Oh yeah, by the way, as you can see here, this has been elongated and two more houses has been set up. What do you got? What do you got? Destiny wood, bricklayer, revolver. Lol. Yeah, it's nothing that I want to use. Um, that I'm gonna keep. As fuck, yeah. Screw. Screw you. Okay, um, yeah. I'm thinking that this room up here is going to be the, um, a new NPC that's uh, come out. I know, I'm not sure if it's uh, 1.3 or what it is, but uh, yeah, the tax collector. Caught in the corruption. Okay, cool. I can go over here. There he is right here. I've built a little area right over here that I can caught and catch him in. So yeah, I got my fishing rod on me. So yeah, let's uh, get over there quick, like. Zoom 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 Okay, let's just get fast down to the ground Then Run for a bit Okay. I like that he has uh, goggles on when uh My dear God. Can't see a goddamn thing, and I must listen to it instead. And there we go. That's the fish I wanted. See, that was a. Uh, Pretty uneventful. Ooh. Oh, 
nice! That's one of the items we need for uh, uh, the cell phone thingy. Fisherman's pocket guide, uh, weather, uh, radio, and a sextant. I got the sextant, and I got the rid of weather radio now. And now I need the uh, fisherman's pocket guide. Raining, uh, 58 miles per hour from the west. Nice. Ah, towards west. Yeah, it's going towards west. Yeah, sorry. Um, going. No, nope, actually, this way. From there, there. Going that way. That way. <laughs> yeah, it's. Um, my camera's, of course, uh, turned around, yeah. Okay, that's pretty cool. And we got some of that. Okay, let's. Um, Um, I'm just gonna go down here and get rid of some of the excess uh, excess package. Okay, and then let's see what kind of uh, colors we can get. Purple ooze dye, reflective metal dye. Negative die and negative die. Okay. Negative die. Reflective metal die. Okay. Okay, let me just. Oh. Okay, and we're gonna, uh, gonna do it over here. Reflective metal die. Okay. Oh. Okay, it's very shiny apparently. Okay, negative die. Oh, they, um, That's right, it uh, makes it all negative, apparently. Nice. Let's see what would happen if I... Um. Oh, that's trippy. And then there's the purple, purple ooze dye. Low. Well, blue acid dye on the leggings. That's down here, and then the this one here. Oh, there we go. I'm pretty sure we already had purple ooze dye that we did. Cool. Well, I think it's uh, about that time again to say thank you all so very much for watching. And as always, catch on the flip side.